Shakuris has fallen, and Amon's grip tightens. If we are to stand against him, we will need more than warriors. As Hierarch, I was made aware of a location where our Kalai scientists experimented on new weaponry in secret. Within the Glacius facility, the Purifier program has been reborn. We must recover this immensely powerful technology. Shakuris is gone. It has become one with the Eternal Night. But the traditions we forged there will remain with us forever. Is that still possible, Matriarch? More so than you may realize. What do you know of the Shadow Walk, Artanis? Little. Your people closely guard their customs. It is our most sacred rite of passage. The Initiate stands alone. Members of her tribe strike against her from the shadows. If she endures, she becomes a Shadow Hunter, true Dark Templar. Why do you speak of this? You stood alone, as Dark Templar, against countless enemies, risking your life for the many. You have walked as we have. You have walked the Shadow Path already, Artanis. You no longer have the Kala. You are Dark Templar. I cannot believe you survived the fight in the Temple Hierarch. Did you have some weapons enhancements I did not know about? And Arudin Shakuras, you were our salvation, and we will forever remember that. At least the Nerezim are safe now. I hope we will be able to rescue our brethren on Ayr soon. At least the Nerezim are... Ah, yes, I see. The physical shape is a deception. That would mean it can be realigned. This decay rate is impossible. No constructed material would behave this way. Unless... I advise against physical contact with the Keystone at this time, Hierarch. valiantly beside us, even unto the destruction of their world. Why? Their homeworld has always been ire. They have never forgotten it, or the sacrifice that delivered them to safety. You speak of Adun, so saith Judicator Zentheon. Adun failed to eradicate the rogue tribes, those who call themselves the Dark Templar. We witnessed the burst of the Twilight Star. In that treasonous instant, Adun ushered the heretics and himself to fate, purifying ire of their taint, but allowing them life. Treason? Adun chose mercy rather than committing genocide. This was a noble act, Preserver. Was it? I see history through the eyes of those who lived it, Artanis. Perhaps this is why you are blind to all that is before you. History's truths are only ever understood looking through the backwards lens, seeing its consequences take root. As a preserver, I have always experienced history as a living, breathing now, as those who experienced it in the moment did. Perhaps I should consider the way you view it. We lost the Kala, and now Shakuris. Yet we still live, and that is no small gift. If only I had heeded Zeratul's warning. We lost the Kala, and now Shakuris. Glacius facility. Within lies the greatest weaponry the Empire ever developed. It is the site of the Purifier Revival Program. Purifiers? The forbidden weapon? They were sealed away by the Conclave, never to be restored. 
The ancient purifiers are not kept here, Preserver. They are still locked away. Here, on Glacius, our researchers have been developing prototype weaponry inspired by that ancient technology. You speak above your caste, Kalai. This is unimaginable heresy. We are outmatched by Amon's forces and facing annihilation. If this technology may help us, we will use it. seen since the Aeon of Strife, before the Protoss were united by the Kala's Light. I'm afraid they returned some time ago, Rohana. We thought them fanatical servants of the Zelnaga for years, but in truth, they had enslaved themselves to Aemon. Why would any being willingly follow Aemon? That is unclear. The Tal'Darim call themselves the Chosen. What Aemon has chosen them for, we do not know. They are dangerous foes who have helped forge the hybrid and shed blood in the name of our great enemy. Protoss turned upon Protoss. The Deul demands retribution for such offense. They must be destroyed. If it is their fate, it shall be. The Shadow Guard. The purifier weaponry that has been researched here could prove to be a valuable addition to our arsenal. That is what I am hoping. Is there any merit to Rohana's fears? The Kalai on Glacius have prototyped the technology with successful results. It is said that these experimentations are no different than the Templar they are replications of. A byproduct of quantum predictive analytics. They were and are still only machines. Do not give them such credence, Karax. We too are machines of a biological nature. I often marvel at the architecture, the design, the careful construction of our form, our machinery. The Zelnaga forged us as we forged the original purifiers. Many of my Dark Templar have volunteered to act as scouts for us. They will keep us aware of Amon's movements. If we are to obtain the Purifier technology, then we must move quickly. The Tal'Darim are preparing to fire upon the facility. Tal'Darim are unleashing their mothership's phase displacement beam against Glacius' orbital defenses. I am First Ascendant Alarak, and I've been charged with destroying this facility. You seek the technology vault, but you are too late. It will be annihilated along with the rest of this pathetic world. Use your time to withdraw from the system, or remain here, and watch your forces burn to ash. I care little which you choose. He is not entirely correct. If we begin now, our forces could outpace the displacement beam. Then we are going in!
replacement beam is advancing. We must reach the vault before it is destroyed. We shall shield this world. For voice. force amassing outside of our nexus point. We must prepare for assault. Wait, these sentries were left behind. Let me activate them. They are quite effective at restoring shields to nearby warriors. are now calibrated to warp them in as well. Station scientists were storing raw solarite here as well. If possible, we should obtain it. Excellent. Solarite gathered. Discovered more sentries. I will activate them now.
manifesting gas. Forces are near the displacement beam. We must remain alert and stay out of its range. Our forces are in mortal danger. Get them away from the beam! Some excitement, Hierarch. Centuries online.
from stasis. I am the voice of the Eclipse. Very wise. I'm detecting movement from the Taldarine fleet. Multiple transport signatures inbound on the facility. Warp prisms. Clever. Alarak is activating the facility's old defenses, using them against us. It shall be as you say. Solarite sample obtained. It shall be as you say. You must construct additional pylons. Intriguing. Cold is the void. samples. They are still in superb condition. You should see them. Weaponry is safely aboard the Spear of a Dune. Wait, there is a prototype warrior here as well. I will have to examine it more closely. 